The Big Fig Mattress and the Wink Bed Plus Mattress. Two supportive hybrids that are designed for heavier folks, but which one is right for you? We're gonna talk about that in today's video. Hey, how's it going? This is Owen, I'm a CNET, and we're gonna have a head-to-head -head comparison between the Big Fig Mattress and the Wink Bed Plus. Now, the Wingbed Plus is technically the fourth firmness option available with the Wingbed mattress, but we kind of consider it a separate bed altogether because the materials are different and it's more expensive than the other Wingbed mattresses. So we're gonna be talking about what these beds have in common, which is quite a lot, and then go into their key differences and try and figure out which one is gonna be best for you and your sleeping preferences. If that sounds good and you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And as always, there'll be a lot of info down below in the description to help you with your online mattress search, including any discounts we can find to help save you a bit of money. First, let's cover the policy info for the Big Fig mattress and the Wink Bed mattress. There's actually not a whole lot different here, which makes my job a little bit easier. Both are gonna ship to you for free inside of a large box. The embossing process is generally pretty quick and easy to do, but for these two beds specifically, they're pretty heavy, so I would definitely recommend having someone there to help you with it. it makes the process go a lot more smoothly, especially if you're getting a large larger size like a queen or a king. Both come with a 120 night in-home trial period, so you have about four months to sleep on the bed at home to determine if you like it or not and it suits your needs. If you decide that they don't for whatever reason, both come with completely free returns within the trial window, so it's virtually risk-free. Both also come with longer than average warranties if you decide to keep it. The Wink Bed mattress is a lifetime warranty and the Big Fig mattress is a 20 year warranty. So virtually an identical set of policies and in our opinion, they're pretty generous. More info about these policies will be linked in the description, including how to actually return a mattress, which might not work exactly the way you think it does. It's actually probably easier than you think it does. Let's start getting into what these mattresses have in common now. And like I mentioned at the top of the video, it's quite a lot. Both of these beds are hybrids, which is what you'd expect when they're designed for heavier folks, which means you get a nice thick layer of pocketed coils as the primary support layer on both mattresses. And on both mattresses, these coils are extra thick gauged and reinforced, which is designed to be more supportive and durable over the long term for heavier folks. According to both brands, they'll be able to support up to two 500 pound people throughout the entire life of the mattress. According to Big Fig, they go all the way up to 1100 pounds. From what I've seen on Winkbed, they don't really make that claim. However, both brands do have a third party durability test that they both undergo. You can check them out down below in the description. So durability isn't something I would worry about with either mattress, regardless of weight. To add to the durability factor, both brands actually feature a pretty thick layer of latex foam within the construction of both of their beds. And latex foam is a generally really durable material that offers a lot of spring and pushback. So again, durability, I think you're set for both Wink Bed Plus and for Big Fig. The firmness level of both mattresses are also gonna be very close together, although this is kind of hard to nail down with mattresses like this. If you are a heavier person, you will generally feel beds to be quite a bit softer than someone who's much lighter than you. And so for beds designed for heavier folks, they will make the mattress quite a bit firmer for someone who is smaller. But if you are in this mattress's target demographic, you will feel it to be quite a bit softer. So in our testing, we found both of these beds to be somewhere around a medium firm, maybe hair firmer than that. I do think, at least to me, the Big Fig mattress feels slightly firmer, but if you are heavier, it'll probably be closer to a medium, somewhere between a medium and a medium firm. So it should be pretty accommodating for all sleeping positions. Now you don't necessarily have to be a heavier person to be interested in one of these beds. Just know that if you're you know, 200 pounds as opposed to 300 pounds, odds are you'll feel it to be pretty darn firm. Where these beds really start to differentiate themselves is when it comes to their feel. So the Wink Bed mattress, you can tell just by looking at it, has more of a pillow top design. And so you get more of that sort of fluffy pillow top feel that you sink into a little bit, but not all that much because of the overall firmness level of this mattress. We like to almost compare the Wink Bed mattress to beds you might find in a nice hotel. This really high quality, very nice, comfortable feel that most people enjoy. The Big Fig mattress though, the latex foam layer that I mentioned, is actually further up in the construction of the mattress, so you wind up feeling that a little bit more. Latex foam has this really springy, spongy, cushiony type quality that I think most people do find quite comfortable. It's just super responsive and you don't really sink into it quite as much. So I wouldn't describe the feel of Big Fig to be explicitly a latex foam feel, more of a neutral hybrid feel with a lot of bounce and responsiveness. So the feels are quite a bit different here. Personally, I find both the Wink Bed Plus mattress and the Big Fig mattress to be quite comfortable. I'm actually a pretty big fan of that nice springy, spongy latex foam feel. 
but I think more people will probably gravitate toward that pillow top feel on the Wink Bed mattress. I think it's pretty much universally comfortable, but that's not to say the Big Fig mattress is uncomfortable. One category I think the Big Fig mattress gets a slight edge is in temperature regulation. This is because the cover is actively cool to the touch because it is infused with what they call thermogel. The cooling factor isn't quite as noticeable to me as some of our favorite cooling beds like the Brooklyn Bedding Aurora Lux, but it is there and I think it will help you sleep a little bit cooler. Especially on a mattress like the Big Fig that you don't really sink into very much at all, I think you're A-OK -okay on temperature regulation. And then another area where Big Fig gets a bit of an edge is pricing. It's gonna be a bit more affordable than the Wink Bed mattress. I mentioned earlier that we basically consider the Wink Bed Plus a separate mattress, mostly because its construction is different. The other beds from Wink Bed don't feature that latex foam layer, and the price is a little bit higher. The MSRP for a queen size Wink Bed Plus is around $2,000, and once you factor in discounts, it should come down to around $1,700. And it usually comes with two free pillows as well. I think that's a solid value. However, the Big Fig mattress is more affordable. The Big Fig mattress, on the other hand, comes in at around $1,800 for a queen size before discount, and right now it's pretty heavily discounted and you can pick up a queen size for $1,350. I don't think that price point will remain year round because it is around the holiday season when I'm recording this video and Big Fig is offering a very special sale. So make sure you look down below in the description for what's current on these beds. However, I think pretty much year round, the Big Fig mattress will be a bit more affordable than the Wink Bed. Just depends on how much more affordable. And that's pretty much gonna do it for today's comparison. I could cover a few more categories like edge support and motion isolation, but I think they perform pretty much the same in those categories, give or take. And it's really gonna come down to your preference on feel between these two beds, in my opinion. Do you want that more fluffy pillow top feel on the Wink Bed Plus mattress or the more responsive neutral hybrid feel of the Big Fig mattress? I don't really think you can go wrong with either bed. I think they're both really solid options at pretty affordable price points for this type of mattress. So I'd say just pick one and see which one you like and you can always return it if you don't like it and try out the other one. But let us know what you think, write us down below in the comments, which of these two beds would you select, let us know. And again, tons of stuff in the description, so be sure to take a look. If you found this video helpful or interesting, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. But that's gonna do it for me. This is Owen, a scene at home. I'll see you in the next one.